Hey guys, welcome to Banker Marketing. So glad you're here. We are inspiring you to chase your dreams online and helping you get there every step of the way. Today we're looking at teams and specifically how to apply background filters to your team's video chats. And it's really quite simple. And if you don't see it, we'll also show you why you don't see it. All right, let's dig in. So switching over to this screen here, you can see when you first start up a video chat, you have just your little screen in the middle, and you should also see this little option here called background filters. Now, if I select this, I can see on the side that, oh, I have all of my background filters. So there's one called blur. It will just blur out your background. And then you can also select a whole bunch of other ones, as well as if you hit add new at the top, it will open it up and allow you to upload your own photos that you've taken. Once you hit join now, you'll join your meeting. And then you can see me full screen and this is me up here doing my thing. So once I'm in this area, how do I change my background filter during a meeting? Well, I can click on the three dots here and I can go apply background filter. Here, same thing. I can select a new background filter and I can even either choose to apply that filter right away or I can hit preview. When you go into preview mode, your original video is cut off and you just preview it on the bottom right. And you can say, yeah, I like that. Apply and turn on my video. And you go back like this. Or you can just hit apply like so. Apply and it will switch your background straight out, which is pretty cool. One thing to note is, for example, I uploaded this with our logo on there and you can see, hey, the logo's backwards. It looks like crap. Why does it look like that? Well, in reality, the logo is actually forward. So when someone else views it, it'll actually be flipped. Just when you're looking at it right now, it won't be. So what if you don't actually see the background filter option. You look down here and you see a black apply background filters is not there, or I only have the option to blur my background, etc. Well, that might be good because of your organization settings. In your organization admin center for Microsoft Teams, if you're an admin, you can take a look here and see meetings and then meeting policies. Within meeting policies, you can look at uh, whichever policy you have enabled. And if you scroll down, there's an option that says select video filters. And here you can control the video filter option for your entire organization. So right now we have it set to all filters. I could say background blur only, background blur and default images, meaning they can't upload their own images or no filter at all. Not allowed to filter your background. Whatever's back there, we want to see it. Uh, so those are your options, and that will be applied to your entire policy that's applied to your organization or wherever you've got that policy enabled. So if you want uh, to have that, that is where that setting is. That's it. That's how you apply background filters. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe. Uh, we're going to be putting up a whole bunch more videos around this. If you're interested in cloud services or need help with Microsoft Teams, reach at the support link below. We'd love to help you out. Till next time, keep learning online.